We're here with Sammy Towell, the uh, first baseman for the first place at Saint Organization. Sammy, coming into the year, he had almost identical team to last year. Only big question mark, a rookie pitcher, and uh, I think he's answering his, answering his critics. Absolutely. Leo, Leo's doing a great job. More than we can ask for. We just want him to be average, and he's been pitching above average, and that's the reason why we're 7-1. Um, our defense, we know what we have, and uh, I think teams are starting to believe in us, and they realize we are a good team, and we're a smart team, and we're a team with veterans, so that's why we're 7-1. No surprise there. Yeah, no, uh, obviously you guys uh, have a lot of experience, the oldest team in the league, and um, with all the youngsters, but uh, you know, now you guys are tied for first with uh, Alley, they just lost today, so um, it should be an exciting race going down to the end of the year. Yeah, it's, uh, me and my brother, I guess, at it again. It's, we're both 7-1, uh, and one. I think we play each other in a couple of weeks. Uh, we got winning next week, Batty, and then we got my brother and Alley. So it should be a good couple of weeks, it'll be a lot of fun. Um, I think that we're going to be playing for first place against Alley in a couple of weeks. And, uh, you know, though you, like you said, there's one bye this year, so we want to get that bye. We'd love to get the week off and have some of our you know, veterans like Buka uh, get some rest and be ready for the playoffs like last year. I think uh, one of the big keys also, Ike Jamal, uh, coming on an off year or a off couple of years, putting MVP numbers this year, really solidifying the team. Oh, he, he, he's great. I did the first year I'm playing with Ike, and the guy is everything – you know, as advertised, the guy flat out can hit, he can run, he plays phenomenal center field. I mean, he is the glue to our team with Mo Sham at short, myself at first, you got Buka, um, and all these other guys are just plugging the holes, and Jack Jamal, and we're just, uh, we're doing what it takes to, you know, we're 7-1, and, one and we, we are a 7-1 team, there's no, uh, it's just not a, you know, myth. Really, a lot of, you know, I guess a lot of people are surprised uh, seeing, uh, you know, Ike Adida against a rookie pitcher. You think uh, Adida would up to have the upper hand, but uh, Leo uh, obviously uh, showed some uh, good the guts. Yeah, he battled. I mean, we, you know, Jackie was up in the first game, bases loaded, two outs. I'm sure that's what they wanted. They got it, and he hit a scorcher to Adam Jamal. Adam made a great play and end the game. Second game, uh, again, Jackie was on deck, and we make the double play, uh, Mo back to me, and you know, we leave Jackie standing on the on-deck circle. So we won two close games. Uh, the first game, it was 7 nothing, and they put themselves in a big hole. And they, you know, luckily we had that 7 nothing lead because we needed all of it. And uh, Ike pitched great. He really, uh, he's, you know, Ike's Ike, so he pitched great. Okay, next week, uh, weather permitting, we got the big uh, all-star game, the over 25, under 25. Uh, I'm sure we're going to announce the uh, selections this week on the Dashes report. Okay. Uh, but I'm sure you're, uh, you'll uh, be one of the ones uh, selected for first base. And, uh, you know, before, uh, in the old days, it might have been, uh, uh, you know, a big uh, mismatch. But now I think they're creeping up, the under-25 team. Yeah, no, they're, they're, they're a bunch of studs. I mean, they have an outfield that's as good as you get. I mean, with Joe Chira and Jackie Towell and... Jack and Batty, yeah. and you got Farker, and I think I heard Farker might be playing first. So, yeah. I mean, they're loaded. Last year was a great game, and we beat them two-one. This year, listen, they're 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 good. I mean, but let me tell you, as long as you have a team with Mo Sham and Henry Shalom and uh, Eddie Rishti and Nathan and all these guys, I mean, uh, we're you know we're still the, we're still a team to beat. Until they beat us, yeah. we're gonna come out and uh, show them who we are. Yeah, you still have Ike Jamal. You still have oh, a lot yeah, of guys. Jamal, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. A lot of guys. Sonny. Sonny Shalom and my brother and who knows who the pitchers are, Ike Dean and oh, yeah, Azer. So, so I don't know the team. I mean, you didn't announce it, so I don't yeah, want to start rolling have, but off. I'm saying I think we still have, uh, they're going to have the big advantage in being pitching. And, yes. Uh, you know, I think that's, uh, you'll show the youngsters a thing or two. Yeah, I know they want to beat us. I know last year that 2-1 stung them big time. Jackie Tal has been talking about it all year. And, um, you know, I think they're going to want to win this game bad. So they're going to be hungry and we're going to be there and we're going to do what we got to do. And hopefully we'll uh, show them how it's done. What would this uh, mean to you this year uh, to get a back-to-back -back championship? I mean, obviously, uh, a lot of people, tough year uh, for you, but, uh, you know, uh, coming into the year, your team, uh, a lot of guys picked you in the middle of the pack, so this it must be gratifying to be 7-1 at this point. Yeah, I mean, last year, everyone counted us out. They didn't think we were for real, and we ended up in first place, held our own around the table, won the championship. This year, again, they didn't think we were a good enough team. They thought our pitching was question mark, which they had a right to. They thought we had some holes, and, uh, you know, I even questioned, I thought we were a 500 team. But, you know, listen, we're just surprising people, and even Jackie told me after the game, he said, you know, you guys are just a smart, you guys play sound baseball, and... You know, I guess that's one of the reasons why we're winning. We know how to win games. We know how to yeah. close out games. Well, that's what it takes. Sometimes it's not the, uh, you know, on paper is the best. It's, uh, look at Saban's team. Fundamental. Yeah. yeah, look yeah. at Saban's team. And the guy has a team that's, you know, great. And one and seven now. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow.
Yeah, they want to change the name for the third time in a row. Yeah. Was it going to be just like Game Over? Uh, no, it was. Okay, let's see, yeah, something yeah. like that. I'm sure you, let's have on come up with a new name, <laughs> and uh, I guess it's that curse of being on the show. I mean, <laughs> I, you won't see me there anytime soon until we win. The, Mo won't let me be on. So. Oh no. No, 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 no way. Not after last year. So uh, maybe after the championship, I'll come and do my, uh, you know, my on the porch after the, the postseason. But oh. uh, you won't see me there till after the season. Okay, you heard it here from Sammy Tao. He's got a flight uh, leaving here. He's got to go uh, recruit some uh, guys in the Vegas League. Yep. And, uh, Triple A. Triple A and Double uh, A Brooklyn League also. Yep. And, uh, so we'll see you and uh, back to the studios. Thank you very much.